What's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. I'm John the Video Guy and in this video tutorial I'm going to be going over my free Mogurt pack that I have available for you guys free down in the video description. So feel free to go grab that. It is the Animated Elements Starter Pack for Premiere Pro. These have a lot of shape elements inside them. You might have seen them used in my previous video tutorials. They're great for identifying certain areas of the screen. But there are also a lot of cool elements in here, such as the swirlies and pops. And I'm going to be featuring how to install them inside Premiere Pro and really how to use the controls. So with Premiere Pro open, to install them, switch to the captions and graphics workspace. And then inside the essential graphics panel, click on the hamburger menu and then click manage additional folders. Click on add and navigate to your Mogurt pack, then click select folder, then click OK. And you'll notice them loaded inside your essential graphics panel. Now you can star them to add them to your favorites. And this is helpful because you can then sort by favorites by clicking on the star in the top right. Now you can see all your favorite Mogurts. So one of the first ones that I'm going to go over is the swirlies. For example, here I have a shot of a motorcyclist. Maybe we want to add a swirly element over him. What you can do is click on one of the swirlies, click and drag this to your timeline. We play this back, you'll notice that we have a swirly, but we can change the properties of this graphic. So when we zoom in here, we can actually click on the Mogurt and then you have options in the top right. You can reposition it. So he's, the swirly is over the motorcyclist. You can scale it up a little bit. You can rotate it as well. You can also change the color of the Mogurt can click on the eyedropper tool and maybe we want maybe some of the sky color in there. There's also an option for turn on glow. And this is nice if you want to add a nice glow to your shot. You have two colors to choose from here. You can also bring down the stroke width. And you have glow radius options as well if you want to bring in the intensity of the glow. So there you go guys. By editing those settings you added a nice swirly element to the motorcyclist clip. Another Mogurt in this pack that's very helpful is the arrow. So you can navigate to your arrow. There's two different arrows. I'll drag in arrow number two. And we can reposition this arrow to kind of point to where he's hammering at. So we can scale this down quite a bit. And we can rotate it and reposition. And likewise, there is an option to change the color and to add a glow. Now, one cool thing about this effect is that you can change the duration of it. So it's really long by default, but if you wanted this to be very short, you can just drag the edge and it will automatically animate on and animate off very quickly. There's also the box and circles. They work very similarly, so I'm just gonna demo the box Mogurt. Go to browse, drag in a box element, when we play this back, you'll notice that we have a nice box. You can edit the size of it, and you'll notice that the X and Y are separate, so you can really fine tune the actual shape that you want. And likewise, you can drag the edge to make it very short. So those are the free Mogurt packs that I have available for you guys. If you want to learn a little bit more about maybe some other free packs and transitions that you can download for Premiere Pro, I did make another video tutorial. Feel free to go watch one right up there. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.